Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Flower Metal. I wanted to do this video today because I recently watched a video by Channel Mum. Channel Mum is a YouTube channel where lots of different mums get together and um, talk about different subjects that they debate or um, interesting things about being a mum or family life. Um, they also have amazing kind of tips and tricks um, on meals and activities to do with your kids so if you don't already know about them go and check them out I'll leave a link to channel mum below they did a video recently on household chores and um, whether it was like a debate as to whether it should be divided 50 50 in the home um, and I'll just talk a bit about what me and John do so we do not have this <laughs> sorted like it's an area of our lives that just keeps coming up again and again. Yeah, so I thought we'd do, I'd do like a, a little video just explaining what we do. So, um, at the moment, John is working full time and I'm at home, so a lot of the time in the day, I end up kind of cleaning after the boys, um, just as we go, tidying up toys, tidying up food, changing nappies, um, sweeping the floors, that kind of thing, generally. Um, and Jonathan comes home and tends to do the washing up um, and a bit more kind of cleaning things. He does the bins. He might kind of do the floors a bit better than I did. My kind of quick jobs sweeping up behind them. Um, so um, I do the laundry. You know, we just kind of very much have like man jobs, women jobs. And um, I know that that doesn't sound particularly like a modern family home but we definitely do split it and um, I wouldn't say it's 50 50 I probably do more because I'm here but um sometimes some days it just doesn't get done and um we haven't really worked out a way of um getting it right what um what channel mum did suggest was um, which I thought was really interesting and quite clever, was writing a message to your husband just to explain the state of the home, to kind of justify it before they get back. And I definitely think I'll do that because um, sometimes I think when John gets home and it, he was just expecting it to be nice and it's just not, um, I haven't had a chance that day to do anything except for keep two toddlers alive and clean. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Um, the, it's, it's definitely, like I said, it's definitely something that we tend to, it's a lot of tension in that area of our home. We haven't got it right, we haven't worked it out. Um, it ends up being a discussion that we have again and again. I find myself feeling guilty for, because I feel like I should have done more um, today, but a lot of the time I just can't, like, I just, I can't even bear it, <laughs> bear the thought of doing more over and above um, and then some days I can and I do um, but for John and I we had very different upbringings and I think that's given us different expectations. I grew up with a single mum so stuff wasn't always done to a high standard. Yes yeah, so that's a bit about our situation. I'd love to hear from you guys um, and see whether you guys think it should be 50-50 or if you are completely fine about doing it um, all or if you don't do much and your husband does it because he enjoys it um, please let me know in the comments below because it's one of those things that just it's really helpful to share as mums and as wives and as families to um, just share and see if we can improve it. I know for me and John, it's something that we need to just deal with and work on because I just don't want him to come home to a messy house and I don't want him to come home and have to do loads of chores. Um, but at the same time, I want to like play and invest in my children and make memories. So um, yeah, there's definitely a balance that is needed. If you guys have any ideas on what you do, what's good for you, um, then please let me know. But I just thought I'd respond to Channel Mum, so um, I will yeah, link their channel down below because it's really interesting and really helpful as a mum and just in family life. Um, thank you so much for watching, lovely ones, and I'll see you soon. Bye!